My dear child, today is a very special day for you, a day full of surprises and great blessings. As you rise to face this new day, remember that my joy is your strength. Many beautiful things await you. Be grateful and continue to trust in me. Do not be confused by the problems you encounter or be intimidated by the challenges you face. You know that I love you and my blessing is with you. You have always trusted in me and believe that I can help you in everything. If you believe so, it shall be. I am aware of your desires and I am pleased with your dreams. I see all your struggles and I have fought your battles alongside you. In your daily journey, I accompany you. And when you sleep at night, I give you the rest you need and increase your faith. Now as the sun rises, I speak to your heart again so that you realize your life is in my hands and today can once again be a wonderful day. You are embraced by a real, omnipotent and merciful God. Never diminish the value you have for me. You are very important. I will be watching over you wherever you go. And if one day you are in danger of straying from my love, I will gently bring you back with care and keep you here in my heart. After reading and listening to these words, I want you to close your eyes and dedicate a minute to me. Just tell me how you feel and what you need today. Give me the opportunity to show you my wonderful love on this day. Let me embrace you, calm you, and show you the true love that comes from heaven. I know how many times you have made mistakes, how many times people have let you down, and how many times you have told yourself that you no longer believe in love. My child, you were promised love, but with self-interest, and that is not true love. True love needs to be pure without hidden intentions. It must be unconditional and surpass the barriers of the physical and the material. This true love you will find only in me. Only I love you unconditionally. Because nothing you do or become could change my love for you. I love you exactly as you are, with your qualities and flaws. I am by your side every day, helping and guiding you through difficulties. I am protecting you from evil all the time and working to give you a blessing. Today I urge you to exercise caution in whom you entrust with your life, to avoid the deep hurts you've previously endured. First and foremost, accept my love and immerse yourself in the peace, security, and truth I offer. Right now I'm placing my powerful hand upon your heart, washing away all your sorrows. Let my love engulf you, feel complete and secure, so you no longer seek this love from others. When you are filled with my love and deeply connected to me, you will not impulsively give your heart away out of sadness or loneliness. You won't try to fill the void in your heart with those who might exploit your vulnerabilities. I am healing that wound, that emptiness within you. I am rejuvenating your weary soul so you can live energized and confident. From this day forward, embrace the genuine and true relationship you have with me. Seek me daily, stay enveloped in my peace, and you will not be deceived again. Accept my heartfelt affection. Embrace my true love. I am with you always and will never let you down. I love you right where you are, you will rise. You have much life ahead of you, many tasks to accomplish, many dreams to fulfill. Show me your faith by trusting in my word and decisively rejecting negativity. Let no words of discouragement escape your lips and do not allow others to implant negative thoughts in your mind. I am the God who gave you life. Your future rests in my hands and my will for you will prevail. This is my decree. I want you to live and from today, awaken each morning with the spirit of a victor. I'm instilling in you the ambition to scale mountains to make changes in your life that will revive your spirit and your health. Yes, it's true. I can heal you. But you must place a higher value on your health and take better care of yourself. 
There is a wonderful future awaiting your family. They are as essential to you as your own life. They are part of your existence. And if I have sustained you with strength until now, it's because I recognize how deeply you care for them. You've prayed for the strength to continue fighting because your family relies on you. I hold all those you love in my hand and though at times you may hesitate, you are the leader of your home. You are not replacing anyone. Others could have assumed this role, but they chose irresponsibility. They dismissed the beautiful blessing of dedicating their lives to such a lovely family out of love. Your children may cause you frustration. They often disobey and disregard you. But believe in what lies deep within their souls, a heart that knows its missteps. As you have prayed, I'm still at work in their lives. Their tears, shed in secret over their attitudes, are slowly nurturing a small seed. And the day this seed sprouts, the ground of their rebellion will shatter with remorse. They will recognize their errors and return to you, seeking forgiveness. You will weep alongside them, but with joy, celebrating the moment your perseverance and dedication finally bear fruit. That's why I ardently desire for you to live. Countless moments of joy await you. You will witness your loved ones overcoming their struggles and triumphing over adversity. My word will be fulfilled. Remain vigilant and prepared. I am here to aid you, and your soul must be alert and receptive. You've expressed feelings of endless weariness, but I urge you to trust in me and seek my presence when burdens weigh heavily upon you. I will provide you with rest. Do not let your anxiety strip away your faith or your peace. The enemy is relentless, always scheming to make you falter, laying snares to drain your spirit and tempt you to abandon your faith. This has always been the case, yet I am constantly guarding you, protecting you from the assaults of adversaries, even in your sleep. You might sense the harshness of the battle, and often you've engaged in significant conflicts without even realizing it. I am your champion in the spiritual realm, battling evil forces, ensuring they cannot touch you when they seek to do harm. You are immensely privileged and blessed. You possess a significant advantage over those who wish to contend with you because you have me. I am your heavenly father, all powerful and unbeatable. Do not perceive your problems as greater or stronger than me. Resist being cornered or overwhelmed by difficulties. Do not succumb to fear upon hearing their threats. You don't need to be flawless or have never erred for me to love and safeguard you, your family, and your entire household. The enemies may rush in with deceit and hollow accusations, with fabricated issues and baseless charges, I will shield you from their harsh onslaughts, and I will lead you out of these trials as both a conqueror and a victor. Do not dwell on past mistakes, what you lack, or your weaknesses. My word assures and promises you that my victory is your triumph. It emanates from my throne, from my very hands. Soon you will receive the recompense for your suffering, the reward for your bravery, the accolade for your resolve to prevail, the crown of life, and numerous blessings that you must embrace and trust in. Affirm with your words and with your heart that you are ready to receive them. I am preparing you to accept all the prayers you have offered up. I seek your well-being, your liberty, your prosperity, and that you may experience boundless happiness that your spiritual life may be fortified, that harmony and peace may return to your family. You endured much in your childhood, and as you grew, those who should have cared for and protected you let you down. I witnessed your tears one night, and they moved me profoundly. My angels and I wept alongside you. As you journeyed through life, I have delivered and shielded you from dangers and even death. I have always seen your true worth, a valuable, intelligent individual with immense courage and a strong desire to advance. You 
you are like a tree that has grown deep roots and sturdy branches. I planted you precisely where you need to be today. I have been preparing you for these wonderful blessings that are soon to arrive. I have endowed you with my spirit of love and power so that your emotions align with your faith, your eternal salvation, your healing, and your emotional and sentimental stability are paramount at this moment. Never forget the power of my love for you, intense and enveloping. It surrounds you with holy and perfect affection. In moments of tears and trials, when you remember me, your soul will find rest and your heart calm. Reach for my hand in the early mornings, throughout your day, and when you return home, weary in the evening. Speak to me, I am always listening. Share with me your needs and what you cherish. Simply voicing these thoughts will bring you a sweet and profound peace. When you express gratitude, a divine oil soothes your spirit, filling your entire being with comfort and encouragement. Whenever you call on me sincerely and with faith, your soul is liberated from anguish. If you ever feel burdened, exhausted, sad, or disheartened, come and take refuge in my embrace. I will replace your brokenness with rest, your tears with joy. Remember, I am your best friend. You are never alone. Come and immerse yourself in my word. Even if loneliness strikes, know that you are safe. You will prevail by holding my hand and resting in my love. You will not fail. Confess your love for me and affirm your loyalty. Your happiness brings me joy and when you are sad, I find ways to bring a smile to your face. I'm not a harsh father. I take no pleasure in your suffering. I am not a merciless God, nor have I abandoned you. Contrary to what some may suggest, you are living in perilous times where many challenge your faith and envy your joy. You must be vigilant about where you walk and to whom you listen. Beware of those who, with promises of peace and prosperity, use deceitful words to lead you into darkness. They may try to convince you that you don't need me, that you should lead your life independently of my guidance. Yet, you are eternally united with me. Even as you navigate valleys shadowed by death, I am with you. But if you choose a mistaken path, you risk forgetting my promises, spurning my love, and believing you don't need my words or protection. Still, I will continue to call you to touch your heart. I will place my hand on your shoulder and gently steer you back towards my will. While I wish for you never to stray from me, should it happen, I know you will long for my presence. The world of darkness holds no true and sincere love. Today, you hear my words as a warning. Deceivers will come, speaking smoothly to lead you astray. Do not follow them. Stay with me. Here, you have all you need, free from problems, lies, betrayals, and the risk of harm. In my presence there is joy and life. Outside only sadness and loneliness await. I saved you and chose you because I desire to see you succeed. You will flourish in life. Trust in my promise. As per my will, you will be a blessing and a role model to your family and community. Your prayers are heard, remembered, and will be answered with far more than you could imagine. Follow me, and I will give you a purpose, make you courageous and victorious. Though enemies may confront you, fear none of them. Receive this blessing that I am bestowing upon you today. I love you deeply, and I am here to grant you the peace you've been seeking, the tranquility that you desperately need. I urge you to calm your spirit and not carry your anxieties like a weight on your back, a lump in your throat, clouding your thoughts. It's crucial for your mind, your soul, and your entire being that today you surrender these negative emotions to me. Understand that by holding on to your fear, anger, and frustration, you open the door to greater affliction. 
I'm aware of your concerns about material matters. Your financial situation remains unchanged and appears daunting, and uncertainties about your health weigh heavily on you. Instead of stewing in these worries night and morning, talk to me. Share your burdens. What seems to cause you the most anxiety, however, is your family situation. It's natural to be deeply affected by your loved one's actions, but you must stop these emotions before they seep into your heart and take root. Declare with faith and determination, my God is with me as a mighty giant, therefore I choose not to fear what the enemies may do. Repeat those words, my child. Know that surrounding you are many warrior angels, poised for battle, ready to defend you at a moment's notice. They await my signal, but they need to see your faith, your active choice to believe. I cannot order them to protect you and lead you to better circumstances until you are ready to embrace greater challenges. I hold countless blessings in my hands that I long to give you, but first, you must surrender all those burdensome emotions to me. I want to elevate you to a level where your faith is active and vibrant. I aim to envelop you with my divine blessing, but you must entrust your entire life to me, holding nothing back. I will forgive your sins, leave your past behind, purify your emotions and intentions, and cast all evil into the sea's depths. It's time for you and your family to receive harmony, peace, and healing. Know that I am always by your side. That is all you need to be aware of today. You may feel discouraged or sorrowful, but as you absorb my words, let them fill your heart with peace, joy, courage, and faith. And now a request from me to you. Remember my tender love throughout the day but cease dwelling on the painful experiences that have marred your life. A new era of restoration and rejuvenation is approaching. Lost blessings will be restored. Doors previously closed will swing open. From heaven, I will shower you with abundant goodness that will enrich and comfort your soul. Walk forward from this day with the conviction that I, your God and Heavenly Father, omnipotent and overflowing with love for you, will always be by your side. Let this assurance ignite within you a fiery passion to live a life filled with purpose and mission. Embrace the desire to adhere to the commandments of your King and Lord, and never feel ashamed of your faith in me and my word. Rejoice in anticipation of the wonders I will perform in your life and in the lives of your family. For all who believe in me have the right to be heard in my presence, to receive the fruits of their faith and obedience. Expect soon supernatural and wonderful miracles. You will witness many positive changes in the lives of those you love, and this will bring you immense joy. Even if challenges and difficulties arise, remain steadfast in your faith, trusting that I will never leave your side. I am always with you in every moment and situation. I am here to help you. You can speak to me with confidence and faith, but you must also be prepared to listen. Engage with my written word. Through it, I will speak directly to your heart. It will infuse you with my spirit, fortifying you with a strength that no one can take away. Promise me with your own words that you will seek me daily with your love and faith. I am always here, waiting for you. Even if your schedule is hectic and you must rush off, try to give me just a minute to receive this word that will uplift you. I am pleased with you. You have touched my heart deeply. Despite the challenges you face, you continue to place your trust in me and have not wavered. Therefore, I affirm today that I will bestow even more blessings upon you and your family. Do not falter or cease moving forward. Do not succumb to fear. Continue to lift your hands to heaven. When fatigue weighs heavily on you during your journey, take a moment to sit and converse with me. Share your thoughts, your plans, what lies in your heart, 
and how you feel. Remember, man does not live on bread alone, but on every word that emanates from my throne. The nourishment I provide now is blessed and will sustain you with encouragement, tranquility and confidence. I offer you my peace. Accept it into your heart today. When the journey seems too difficult to continue, let the flame of my love remind you of my constant presence. Do not fix your gaze upon people. They can fail you. Do not rely solely on others' affection and approval. While it is true that I created you to love and be loved, remember that the only true, eternal love that will always be yours is my steadfast love, which will never fail or forsake you. Guard your heart against those who might abandon you. Do not entrust your future to those who may stop loving you after receiving everything from you. Do not give the highest place in your soul to those who could betray you, hurt you, and disrupt your life. You have sought hope, and here it is. You have prayed for peace, and now it is yours. Remind yourself that you are not alone, that you are not forsaken. Even if your closest family or friends might leave, know that my boundless and magnificent love is always available to you. It is a profound joy to realize and feel that your Heavenly Father cares for you deeply. I am fully aware of your need for these words. I am eager to help you navigate through your challenges, to overcome discouragement, and to continue forward without losing faith so that you can succeed and flourish. Trust in me as your Heavenly Father. Feel free to converse with me and share your needs, for I also desire for you to perceive me as a close friend. I am ready to extend my hand to you, assuring you that I am always attentive, always listening. Engaging in conversation with me is beneficial. It heals your soul, calms your mind, and by verbalizing your feelings, you activate your faith setting the stage for miracles to unfold. Today is the day for open communication between us. Speak freely about everything on your mind, but also take the time to listen as I speak to you. Know that I am not here to judge you, scold you, or remind you of past failures. Feel my spirit gently whispering in your ear, assuring you of my love. I eagerly await each morning for you to wake and express your need and love for me with your thoughts. These are the praises that reach my throne. As the sun rises, know that my presence envelops your life, your family, and your home with love and protection. In the challenges you face, remember that I am here, ready to assist you with anything you ask for your blessing. I will respond swiftly enveloping my response in my love. You have been faithful even in small things. Now I will trust you with greater things. In your time of need, you remained faithful. Thus, I will fill your life with abundance, providing even more than you have requested. Neither the world nor people can offer the love and peace that only I can provide. I have endowed you with faith, strength, courage and perseverance to move mountains and triumph over every problem. You serve a real, almighty and supernatural God. Acknowledge this, talk to me and affirm your belief in me. Now rise up and live life joyfully, applying the words you hear and read today. The doors I open for you, no one can close. I will restore the blessings that were taken from you and peace and tranquility will return to your heart. I understand your needs and have heard your prayers. I am aware of your struggles and pains. I have been preparing the ground for your blessings, sowing seeds of love and words of victory that will bring about a supernatural transformation in your life. Though you may not yet see it, the circumstances around you are already changing. I am influencing hearts, making decisions, clearing obstacles, and arranging everything to construct the holy path down which your blessings will flow. Do not let discouragement or doubt cloud your faith. 
I know there are times when you feel as though you're in a desert, distant from my promises, with unresolved problems stretching endlessly before you. Remember, even in those barren places, I made water spring forth for my people. Just as I provided them with sustenance in their time of need, I will provide for you. I am the bread of life. Those who come to me will not hunger, and those who believe in me will never thirst. Be patient, for everything has its appointed time. The journey through adversity is as significant as the blessing itself. It is within these trials that your character is forged, teaching you to rely wholly on me and trust in my unfailing love. Even when you cannot see my immediate response, know that I love you deeply. Maintain patience and cultivate trust. Hold fast to hope and keep a grateful heart even in adversity. Be thankful for the small joys, the blessings, the people, and the challenges you encounter daily, for I am actively working through them all. Give thanks in all circumstances, for this is my will for you, that your heart remains thankful amidst conflict, preparing your spirit to embrace the victory I am about to deliver. In your journey through life, you will undoubtedly encounter challenges that may seem insurmountable. However, it's crucial not to be swayed by what you see, but to be guided by your faith. Do not succumb to threats. Instead, confront challenges with courage and conviction, trusting that I am here to strengthen and sustain you. My promises are steadfast. I do not deceive. Stay true to your path. When fear arises during turbulent times, turn to prayer. Come to me each morning, listen, and absorb my words that tenderly reassure your soul to fear not, for I am with you. Do not lose heart, for I am your God. I will strengthen you, I will surely help you, and I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. I have specific plans for you, plans to ensure your welfare, and not to bring calamity, to provide you with a future filled with hope. Remember, my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my ways. As high as the heavens are above the earth, so are my ways and thoughts above yours. I command you to be strong and full of faith, to persevere regardless of the obstacles you face. Know that I will never leave you nor forsake you. My support is unwavering because my love for you is everlasting and unfailing. This love cannot be taken away. It is ever enduring and infinite. When you navigate through rivers of difficulty, trust that you will not be overwhelmed. And when you pass through fires of hardship, believe that you will not be scorched. The flames will not consume you. I hold you in the palm of my hand. I have redeemed you and I know you by name. You are mine. As your shepherd, you shall want for nothing. I make you rest in lush pastures and guide you lovingly beside tranquil waters. I restore your soul and lead you along paths of righteousness, enveloping you in my care and ensuring your safety. Even as you traverse dark and formidable valleys, you will not fear any harm because I am by your side. My love and my Holy Spirit accompany you, providing comfort and peace. My goodness and mercy will follow you all the days of your life. I go before you to clear your path and open new blessed roots. I am your refuge and strength and ever-present help in times of trouble. Trusting in me, you will find courage, strength, stability, wisdom, and patience. Remember, all things are possible with me. Even when the world seems to close its doors, the doors I open for you will remain wide open. Now come forth with faith, step into my presence with confidence, and joyfully receive the supernatural blessings I am ready to pour out upon you. Continue to move forward. There is no adversary, discouragement, sorrow, or frustration that can deter you. Deep within your heart lie dreams, and within your spirit, 
a vision. You possess a profound love for your family and recognize me as your God. When fatigue and lack of motivation overwhelm you, when you can no longer recall the happiness you once felt, come to me. Let us converse as close friends. Avoid confiding your deepest concerns to those who may appear supportive, but actually sow seeds of doubt and bitterness. They may have ulterior motives, offering an ear while secretly intending to steal your peace, sap your energy, crush your remaining faith, and destroy your joy. I truly love you. You don't need to see me with your physical eyes to feel and know my presence is real. I hear you. I comfort you. I am your steadfast friend. My intentions for you are pure, and the plans I have for your future are filled with hope and promise. I desire the coming years to be abundantly blessed for you. Your sins I have cast into the depths of the sea, and each time you approach me on your knees to discuss your challenges, I will provide you with courage and security. What I ask of you is simple. Offer me your sincere heart and a bit of faith, even if it seems as small and fragile as a seed. Though it may appear insignificant to the world, it has the potential to grow into a fruitful, mighty tree. Let go of false friends and discard empty thoughts. Return to nourish your spirit with my word and fortify your faith with the promises that kindle a fire in your heart as you read them. There is profound power in every word that touches your soul and every inspired sentence I write upon your heart. Amen.